Seré el mar que no olvidaré De donde vengo ni dónde voy Money World What is going on? What's going on? Good people of YouTube, welcome back. Welcome back to our classy academy. To a place where we teach how to become classy. Ladies, shout outs, shout outs. First, shout out to our confident, intelligent, assertive, and respectable man. And also, shout out to you, ladies, beautiful, feminine, friendly, and inspirational. How are you all doing? How are you all doing tonight? Right. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Gentlemen, you better strap up because tonight I'm going to teach you something very, very, very interesting and very, very useful. Gentlemen. If you want to become a, a gentleman or a classy man, how many times did you ask yourself, what are the steps? Hmm? How many times did you ask yourself, what are the ways? Or, or even better, even better question. Gentlemen, how many times did you ask yourself, is a gentleman can you can you actually be a born as a gentleman the answer is nope nope you're not born as a gentleman no 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 you can be born in a in a high class society in the in a family of uh, high earners your parents and your family can earn millions billions of dollars or whatever billions of dollars per year but if there is no sophistication in behavior, mind, and heart, everything falls apart. Ah, that kind of rhymes. Heart and mind and heart. Good. That kind of good rhyme, though. Or not. Well, let's get busy. Let's get busy. So, tonight's topic. 21 way to cultivate yourself as a gentleman. Mm -hmm. Yep, you heard me right. You heard me right. Tonight I'm going to teach you 21 way to cultivate yourself as a gentleman. Okay. A four word before we start officially. Since uh, this is going to be a big topic, I separate this topic in three videos. Yep. One, two, three. And they're all coming up in the following days. So, part one is tonight. Part two is going to be on Tuesday. And part three is gonna be on next Saturday. So stay tuned because it's gonna be connected. Yep, it's gonna be all linked up. Now, to begin with, how to become a gentleman, or even better, a way to become a gentleman. Number one, gentlemen, I don't think I should ever say this, so I should uh, say this more than, more than a few times, but I have to. Number one is show respect to everyone. Oh yes, gentlemen, you heard me right. Show respect to everyone. Woof. You, why? Hmm. You, you guys, maybe we're, we're taught to show respect to only those who are familiar with you, like family, friends, relatives, and uh, some of your co-workers. But that's wrong. That's wrong. Why? Because a classic gentleman is very sophisticated kind of man, okay? And he shows respect to everyone. What does it mean? It means that you have to show respect to everyone even if others, if this other person is not showing respect to you. Why? Because in the long run, this other person will eventually realize, okay, you're not you're not a chameleon you're not a you're not, you're not a pretender okay 
So, show respect to everyone and, and eventually, to those who are disrespectful to you will eventually become respectful. So, gentlemen, respect and showing respect to everyone, even those who are disrespectful, disrespectful for you, is a big thing. That's uh, number one. That's uh, absolutely number one. You cannot skip that. No, you cannot call yourself a gentleman if you don't show respect to everyone. No matter what. Or no matter who this person is. So, show respect. Show respect. Next. Say please and thank you. What does it mean? It means being polite. So this is connected to the number one. Why? Because is this because politeness goes a lot with respect. So you show respect, you show politeness, you have nothing to fear. You have you have nothing to be afraid of. So saying please and thank you, believe it or not, sometimes can uh, these two words can have a big impact. However, I know that most of you have been thought some of you. I've been thought that uh, saying please and thank you is some weakness or some of um, how should I put this uh, not to be slammed by YouTube algorithm. Mm -hmm. That reason is not a very interesting thing. Hmm? So, but so one thing being polite, but is other thing being a kiss ass. So. Saying please and thank you to other person can sometimes mean, mean a lot. So, let me give you an example. Let's just say you, you walk in a, in a store, okay? And this store has just finished the remodeling and you have, you have no clue where everything is, right? So, what do you do? You say, excuse me, can you please help me out find this and that? See? Being respectful, being polite towards a worker there, being this a man or a woman, can mean a lot. Because believe me, those people, especially average people, or blue, let's call them blue collar, yeah, blue collar people, average blue collar people usually are always slammed with disrespect, with bashing, with shaming into their society. So that's bad, and we and this is something we don't teach in this classy academy. Nope. Here we're teaching classiness, manners, and proper way of conduct. For who? For whom? For both men and women. So to continue, saying please and thank you can mean a a lot to other person, especially average person who. Who is working its butt off from from morning to night so he can he can feed himself or feed the family? Okay, so same phrase and answering and finish right the conversation with thank you, have a good day, have a good evening, have a good night, etc. etc. Or you can also add uh, depending on the season. For example, the holidays. You say thank you, Merry Christmas, or I don't know, depends on the day or on the occasion of the day. So, being polite to that to everyone is essential. So, pol number one, respect. Two, pol politeness. Continue. Work hard and smart. Oh yeah, I'm going there tonight. I'm going there tonight. I know that many of you have been taught to work hard. However, they haven't told you to work smart, okay? They haven't told you to, to work, work smart. So, it's okay, okay? You know that some of you are really lazy to work yourself, work towards your goal. So, how to reach it if you're intelligent and uh, have a decent work ethic? Everything in your life, starting from improvement, transforming your image, building your relationships, the career, family, you need to work hard. And we 
all need to smart up. Work hard. We do also yep, use the brain. Use the brain, ladies and gentlemen. Use that the brain of yours. Yep. Working hard hard is I because by working smart you are uh, helping. Not only skills, but your new way you're being yourself. And you're using ask questions how to solve problem. Anyway. Use that brain of yours, okay? Okay, use that, okay? Alright. Once you know more efficient in time consuming ways, that means and you can work hard. It's more hard. We win session out perform co workers with your company. Next, pretty gentlemen, because I'm going there tonight. See it most. Yeah, I, I said it. See it who needs it. You call yourself. Aspect. Don't always see who knows. You can. Know. We all know earlier that childhood they if we are with our family values, we will always give give it to someone else. And now. And in some ways, we are all guilty of the same thing. Oh, yes, we have the same thing. When we hit when we hit things, we become self. And we give a. We don't care anyone. Doesn't matter. See, pregnant, a person with a disability of any kind. Care. We are not polite. Yes, we are not showing our respect to a person. But this group of people, that's not something that's acceptable. Bottom line. And offer seat who needs it. That's a big thing. For other people, other, other person, but small. so doing a small things in a lot to other person. All right, let's hit that music. Oh yeah, we are back. We're going to number five now. So, what's next? Pause and write down in the comments what is number five. What is a number five way? I see, man. Let's continue. I see, man. Or is what refined. Is number four way, way number five? Is how do you expanding your vocabulary and finding the, the sophisticated 
refers to describe or comments on situations if or within people around you. Find and even if you don't know so much words right now, especially sophisticated fine words, most often can go online, for example, Oxford Dictionary of Language or, or or any other certificate certificate. Uh, dictionary which is which has a certificate and there by expanding your vocabulary and and cultivate yourself to be more refined in your behavior which in the end brings us to number eight you You know it, you know it, you know it. Number one and two is what? Respect and politeness. This connects automatically to number one, respect, try and respect your sick. Refined. And cult as a being refined. Next, be careful of that one. I always have a first one. Like, oh. oh, yeah, I hate the guilt of that. We are all guilty. Here's we walk down the, down the street. In any city, anywhere. With absolutely classy. Then what? What happens? And especially approaches you. Then what happens? There, at her private. You have to look the eye, okay? In the eye, in the eye, in the eye. Eyes, not heads, the eyes. Next, essential. Communication and into an intuition also. Not only Yourself, but communicate with others, especially if we meet our co-workers or a long time, we need to have power. The grip of the other, especially is your senior. Or your boss. So firm guideline lines, which also up in in upcoming videos. Uh, and last, here's why I know you think that all the size shirt 
rip off jeans are uh, good for Asian. Nope. Oh. Normal casual or bit casual, it's a dress code. Do not happen. What happens? Again. Just like Thanos. Boom. With Infinity Gauntlet and Reality Stone. With where's the drop of, where's the draw wardrobe means what? You need to have clothing in your wardrobe you can tweak in what way dress well for any occasion it not only means having a good wardrobe but the rule is you need to be you need to know how to dress not only well but better than others and you're a winner and you are a winner so gentlemen this now ends the part this with this I'm going to end the